music industry is going? What do you think would be the new music of the 80s? Well, since uh, the industry is more or less in the hands of the accountants, um, you should go off and see an accountant. Go to H&R Block, talk it over with the guy who's uh, preparing your income tax and ask him what kind of stuff he likes. And chances are, within the next 10 years, whatever he says will be what everybody else is listening to. All right, thanks a lot. Okay, thanks Bye. for your call. Bye-bye. Yeah. Hi, you're live on Five All Night, Live All Night. Hi, Matt. Hi. Hi, how are you doing? Good, who's this? This is Susan Carr from DC. Hi, Susan. <laughs> oh, Susan's got the giggles. Okay. Now, stop giggling long enough to ask Frank something. After all, you have Frank Zappa here on the phone and on your TV. Uh-huh. Talk to him. Oh, thanks. <laughs> I was just wondering, uh, Frank, have you heard, you, you must have heard, you know, the B-52s and on the new wave and everything. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I was just wondering, you know, what do you think about it? And, you know, do you think it'll be around to stay or what? Well, some of it will and some of it won't. Some of it is uh, very uh, expendable and some of it's interesting. Uh-huh. Well, that's good. Can I ask you one more question? Sure. We saw, I know you were talking about um, the disco fever. Yeah. And um, we were just wondering, you know, we saw that show and everything, and we just were wondering, you know, how you scored. How I scored? You, yeah. mean, you mean the scores that I gave to the contestants? No, 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 no. no. <laughs> no she wanted to know if, if you scored. Oh, you mean did I wind up uh, pooching the girl with the feathers in her hair? <laughs> yeah, I guess so. <laughs> Let me leave that to your imagination. Thanks for your call. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye. So long to BC. It's the Jesuit school, so you have to... Mm -hmm. Hello, you're live on Five All Night, Live All Night. Hi, Matt. How you doing? Good. Hey, uh, terrific show you got going tonight. I really like it. Oh, wait till... You think this is hot. Wait till the snake comes out. Oh, wow. Well, I like snakes, but uh, I don't want to get too close. This is fine. That's okay. It won't come through the TV. Oh, that's... Do you have a question for Frank? Yeah, I'd like to ask Frank what kind of approach he takes to writing a song. Does he think of himself more as a, more as a composer and try and uh, create, you know, a kind of a classic or something? Or is it just a typical song? Um, Depends on the song. You know, is he just writing something or is he trying to compose it? Well, the act of composing is the act of uh, enforcing a structure on the elements that you're dealing with. You know, I'm not always dealing with words and notes. Sometimes I'm dealing with things that are some other stuff. Where do you, uh, where do you get the ideas for your song? Uh, on shows like this. <laughs> you're going to sing a song? You're going to make up a song right on the spot like uh, Mac Davis does? No, how about we'll just uh, dedicate the movie Baby Snakes to what's going to happen to you when you open that bag later. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I was also wondering uh, how Frank Matt just stays so straight with all the strange things that he does and he writes. Uh, how does he do it? Like that film that he showed, that was pretty wild. And, uh, you know, that's not the kind of thing that a straight person would do. When you say straight, do you mean well, straight in the terms Frank of doesn't drugs? Frank any drugs at all never really got into them. Well, the problem is, my friend that since most people in the United States are drug users, it's very hard to imagine somebody who doesn't use any. That's why I have all these problems with people asking me about using drugs. Everybody else uses them from, you know, the kids at school to the people who are working in the government. I just happen not to like them. It's as That's simple it. as that. We'll take one more call. Hi, you're live on Five All Night, Live All Night. Yes, um, Frank. Yep. I read somewhere in a magazine, huh? I don't know if this is, I should name the name of the magazine, but the question, but what I read was is that you use all the notes out of a scale to, um, in a certain voicing. My question is, is take the Phrygian scale, how do you use all the notes out of that scale considering that you have the flat two and the flat six and that it clashes and causes flat nines in, in this voicing? I can't believe you asked that question. That was going to be my next question. But as long as he asked it, Frank, how do you do that? The reason that you can do anything like that that you want is because some people like to hear flat nines and all that stuff. <laughs> Frank Zappa, I, I thank you for being my guest. You're going to be at the music hall tomorrow night. True. Yep. Uh, we're going to see one more clip. Tell us, tell us what we're going to see. You're going to see a song called City of Tiny Lights. It's another excerpt from the movie Baby Snakes, which is coming out in June. Thanks, Frank. You're welcome.